Hey guys, welcome back. Today we are going to play with the Natasha Denona Boxy Exclusive Palette. They sent this to a ton of influencers so that we can play around with it, show you what it look like, and kind of create some looks and get you guys pumped for the palette. Just know, I know you're gonna be like, ooh, I don't think I'm gonna get it. My understanding is this palette right here is going to be in the high rotation, meaning that many, 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 many people are gonna get this over the alternate. Alternate or alternative? I don't even know if I'm saying it right. All I know is that most charmers will be receiving this palette over the opposite product. And what's friggin' awesome is that this Natasha Adenona palette will be going in the base box, which is is really exciting because a lot of base box charmers feel like they've been left behind a little bit so I think it's awesome that boxy charm is including this full size this is a full size Natasha Denona palette in their $25 box. The reason why I say full size is because they do create a mini which retails for $25 and it's much smaller than this. It looks like this, but the pans are much smaller. So this would be the full size of that version. <laughs> when I received the package, I got the palette along with this card over here, which shows the shades of the palette, of course. And then on the back, it has some information. It says, fall in love with the Peak Palette. So this one is called the Peak Palette, super cute. They have shade names in the back. So make sure you check the back for the shade names. That is awesome. Paraben free, not tested on animals. Okay, awesome. Natasha took inspiration from peak foliage season when the leaves start to change colors in autumn to match the feel of the pigments and the palette's launch time. The peak palette has five pants, including four warm tone mattes and one metallic in the shades Aya, Jasper, Thorn, Amhara, and Shine. So you guys can see my face is pretty much done and I am like feeling the fall vibes right now. So I'm gonna zoom you guys in and we're just gonna play around with the palette. That's the whole purpose of this video. I'm gonna take my hair and I'm gonna like do one of these. <laughs> my lids are primed and ready to go. I'm gonna grab a blending brush and I'm gonna go into this shade over here, which I think it's called Amhara. I hope it is like, I don't know what order it is in the back. So I'm assuming it's Amhara. Yes, it is Amhara. Yes, I'm right. Oh, I dipped my nail into it. Ugh. We're gonna dip into that and I'm gonna apply that here on the crease. I can already see it is a very pretty shade. I was excited for this palette from the moment we knew it was coming. And when I got the like the sneak peek and saw it in person for the first time, I was like, OMG. I just wanted to dip my fingers into it. Of course I couldn't. And honestly, I think this is great because um, the palette in the October box, at least one of them, the Illuminati and Issa, that palette was no good. Like it was, it honestly, I was so disappointed in it. I was just like, I didn't even know if I wanted to keep it. It's that bad. Like it's, I, I don't even, I don't even. All right, so that shade is pretty and it's on the crease and it's doing its thing. It's blended in, it looks bomb. Now I'm gonna dip into this like burnt orange shade. It does look like a leaf, right? And that one, I believe its name is Jasper. I'm gonna dip into that one. And I wanna apply that directly above the crease. Just be careful because this is so pigmented. <laughs> That's a pretty shade though. I think I'm gonna take this very same shade and I'm gonna drag it on the bottom portion cause it looks so pretty at the top. So we're gonna go ahead and just wing this as per usual. And I only dipped into the pan once and the pigmentation is already there. So that is a breath of fresh air. But then again, it is a Natasha Denona palette. She's well known and her formulas are really nice. So I really wasn't expecting any less than what I'm getting right now, which is Awesome. I'm gonna grab another brush and I'm gonna dip into this uh, middle shade here, which is called Thorn. And I'm gonna add that baby onto the outer portion out here, just the outer V. I'm gonna grab an itty bitty brush and I'm gonna dip into that vanilla shade whose name is Aya. And we're gonna apply this on the inner portion of the eyes, blending up just slightly, not too much, just like the maybe one third of the way in. I'm gonna grab another eyeshadow brush and I'm gonna dip, oh, so in this case we've used all five shades, that's awesome. I'm gonna dip into, <laughs> okay, the shade Shine. 
and we're gonna apply her on maybe more than the middle, kind of like the middle, but taking up a little bit of the beginning of the eye, a little bit of the end of the eye, because we want this gold shade to blend. When you do that, you are gonna lose a little bit of that brown because the gold is taking over a little bit of the space of the brown. So with no additional product on your brush that you applied that, that deep brown with, you just wanna like tap on top of that. That's a good way to blend, kind of going back and forth with the shades. This look will turn out very pretty whether or not you apply a pair of falsies, but I wanna show you guys what it's going to look like if you just apply some mascara and then I'll add some lashes on top of that so you'll see the difference. Here is the eye with just two coats of mascara. And here's the eye with a really simple but fluffy lash. I kinda like it with the lash better. And just like that, I was able to create a beautiful fall eye look. Now let's get into spoilers. If you enjoy unboxings, makeup tutorials, and beauty exclusives, make sure you click that subscribe button down below. And if you don't mind, please click the like button and the notification bell. That way YouTube lets you know every single time I upload a new video. In the month of November, BoxyCharm is going to be featuring so many amazing brands from Benefit Cosmetics to Milk Makeup, Jouer, Ilamasca, Smashbox, and Natasha Denota, of course. But there have been a ton of questions with regards to additional spoilers being that, you know, like November is literally around the corner and <laughs> there aren't really that many spoilers out there there are not actually choice items. The first official spoiler for the base box is this product over here which you saw in action a few minutes ago. But I just left a Zoom meeting where they released the second official spoiler for the November base box. This product is going to be featured across so many boxes so it's not like just a handful of people will be receiving it, a large amount of us will be getting it. It is the Snow Mushroom Water Serum by Volition Beauty. Now I have it open here on the website. I'm not familiar with the brand. I appreciate that they did this whole presentation to educate us on their products and or their brands because honestly, this is the first I hear of any of it. They're called Volition Beauty and they create beauty items based on your feedback. We already know that everyone has like a very different type of skin concern, skin issues, or just different skin in general. And so it's one of those things like what works for me may not work for you, but Felician Beauty takes your suggestions and puts them into action, creating products that you're interested in seeing on the market. What's really different is that they're creating items that aren't already out there, like the Snow Mushroom Water Serum. Like, I've never heard of that before. And so it's one of those things, like, on their website, you can totally fill out a form suggesting the type of product with ingredients and all that good stuff that you'd like to see, and then they put it up for a vote, and basically they create the products and put it out on the market. Now, it is very important for me to note that their website says it is always clean and cruelty free. Everything we make is certified clean, no parabens, no sulfate, no animal cruelty. Yes, it's possible. I'm gonna link them down below. Make sure you guys go check out the website, get a little more information on who they are, what they stand for. And in the description box, there's also an exclusive discount code that Volition Beauty has released for Charmers. So um, if you're interested in snagging anything or getting a nice discount on it, make sure you use that discount code. But right now I wanna talk about the actual spoiler. So the Snow Mushroom Water Serum retails for $62. Yes, I know. It is a one fluid ounce bottle. The description says, Snow Mushroom. It's nature's sponge. It holds nearly 500 times its weight in water. It's the wonder ingredient in this hydrating face serum that delivers a surge of moisture as it naturally minimizes the appearance of pores. Their website will provide you a full list of ingredients as well as a quick video on how to use their product. They have a 4.9 rating out of 363 reviews, which is a, like for, to me, that sounds great. It's something to look forward to because again, most charmers will be receiving that, which is awesome. I know you guys were excited for Natasha Denona. I know you guys were excited for Milk Makeup. I know you guys were excited for Smashbox, but this is a skincare brand that is sold at Sephora. It is expensive and it's all new to us and that's the point of signing up for subscription boxes. Is it trying new brands? 
that we've never heard of or seen before. So this would be all new to me if I were to get it in one of my boxes. That would be really exciting. Let me know down below what do you guys think about the makeup look, the eyeshadow palette, the new spoilers, and everything we're looking forward to for the month of November. Check out the videos that are popping here on screen. These are more unboxings and makeup tutorials I know you're gonna enjoy. Thank you for watching this video and I'll see you on the next one. Bye guys.